Yeah, it was getting a little too cramped in here, man. Like, yo, you guys, can you guys wait outside, please, and wait your turn? Damn, dude. Wait, did one die? Oh, one died. <gasps> yes, fi one finally died to the paw 20. <laughs> How's it going everybody? My name is Armando. Welcome back to a Dead Frontier video everybody. So guys, this is going to be a special video, alright? As you can tell, the equipment that I have is very, very outdated, okay? This is equipment that was equivalent to like having a GAL-19 back in the day, honestly, you know, before you can afford the GAL-19. It was the dream equipment, 577 Rex. Vulcan and the Paw 20. The Vulcan back then cost 11 mil, the 577 Rex I believe was 10, 9 mil, and then the Paw 20 was also 10 mil. So in order to have these three weapons, you needed at least 30 million. Okay, that was back in 2011, if I remember correctly, I'm not too sure, but this was the Chugo equipment, okay? This was the equipment that everybody needed and wanted. I mean, it will get the job done. Uh, people still believe these, this equipment is still decent in South Bunker. I believe it is, even though, you know, Vulcan is pretty much trash. <laughs> but that's not the point. All right. I mean, with this equipment, honestly, you can do pretty well in the South Bunker. It's not that bad. All right. And right now, guys, we're going to go fight a Black oh, yeah. Titan. So our first boss fight is going to be with... Oh, crap. I, I actually missed that. All right. So I'm still trying to find out where the heck is this Black Titan? Like, it says four to the left. Is this it? Oh my god, three hits. Oh, yep, yep, definitely here. He is definitely here. I have some aggro. S 16 damage? Oh, man. <laughs> okay, so it's not that terrible. Not that good, but not that terrible. Because back then, you didn't you didn't have a Vulcan to destroy. You had a Vulcan to keep him at bay, so then, you know, you can kind of have some distance between you and the boss. Obviously, when it comes to a Black Titan, it really won't matter because a Black Titan cannot be knocked back. I can say that way, but no, nevertheless... You just wanted to get rid of the the aggro, okay? There you are, Mr. Black Titan. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep continue um taking out the Vulcan just to you know get rid of some of the the aggro behind me. Like I said, guys, 90% of the time you're going to die due to aggro. Nothing else, nothing less, nothing more. And one of the biggest tips I always tell people: circle around the area once or twice until the aggro is officially like gone, and then you can continue. You know, then you can take out your heavy shot or whatever weapon and just fire away in peace and I have aggro come up behind you and just like that there should be no more aggro now here comes the 10 hour you know the 10 hour torture of taking on a black titan I still don't know why people love taking these guys down I hate ti black titans they take forever yeah this is gonna take me about 30 hours before I can kill this guy I mean I am using a 577 Rex which is honestly a decent sniper but you know this guy has like 100 billion health so it's gonna take me a minute guys a <laughs> long minute Jesus guys, this is gonna take a minute. But I mean, overall, the damage on the 577 Rex isn't too terrible. I'm doing ar around almost 200 damage with a critical hit. Not terrible at all, guys. Like I said, you want a weapon that does high damage. That's why I said one of my goals for the Hardcore Death Frontier series is to have like a Greyhawk or a 577 Rex. But since I'm already doing pistols, it's kind of a disappointment because, you know, it's just, there's no way I'm gonna be able to do snipers and pistols. So, no, well, it is what it is, right? <laughs> Oh my god, look, he's flinching, he's flinching, guys, and I haven't gotten hit once. And yes, I know I have the speed boost, that's helping me out, but hey, man, I, I might do the same thing when I go free-to-play, you know, when I do this against the Black Titan. <laughs> and trust me, damn it, I will do it. I will do it. All right, guys, so he's already bleeding. He can't take much more, so I'm going to use the most powerful weapon known to man. Oh, yeah. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Yeah, that's a... Oh, wow, he died. <laughs> and just like that, we took it out. With the most powerful weapons from 2011. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, that, I guess I don't ever change. <laughs> Alright, boys. So we got some long arms. One right. One down. Some light. Oh, my God. Come on. Critical hits, man. They have to be on point. They have to be on point. I mean, this shouldn't be too bad. Should be pretty easy, to be honest. But yeah, long arms, man. They're just, they're just annoying. They, they really are. They're not really the, the funnest guys to go against, but... You know, they're pretty easy at, at the same time, though. A few inches later. It was getting a little too cramped in here, man. Like, yo, you guys, can you guys wait outside, please, and wait your turn? Damn, dude. Wait, did one die? Oh, one died. <gasps> yes, fi one finally died to the paw 20. <laughs> you guys are doing too much right now. Like, yo, thank you. Thank you very much. Jesus, man. All right, we finally got three dead with the paw 20, dude. Dude, this thing is still a freaking monster. Love the paw 20. I've, it's always been one of my favorite grenade launchers back in the day. And that's why it costs like 10 million to one. Dude, look at this. Oh my god, more zombies! Yo, you guys gotta chillax! Oh my god, bro, these guys just aren't letting up. They just they just keep coming. They just want the smoke. I don't know why they want the smoke. Like, if it was me, I would not want that smoke. I'd be like, nah, he just killed like 50,000 of my comrades. Let me just back off. 
Dude, this is just this is just annoying, honestly. <laughs> like, sure, they're not getting through the gate, but damn, dude, the ones that are the ones that are annoying me, man. Dude, look at the dogs. Look at the dogs. Look at the dogs, man. They just don't stop, man. Like, yo, relax, relax, Billy Bob and Bill. Damn. Oh, there we go. We gotta use the paw again, bro. The paw. The paw. Dude, the amount of dogs in this area annoying. But the paw doesn't care. The paw will destroy you. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm near the end. The end of the tunnel, man. The end of the tunnel. Okay, one is dead. Now the last one should remain. Dude, if I see another long arm, I think I'm just gonna dip. <laughs> Screw the loot. So, oh my god, we're finally done. We finally killed each and we finally killed everything. Oh my god, bro. Oh, and now here they come. They want to the smoke. You guys don't want to smoke, trust me. I killed off like six long arms, 40 dogs. You guys don't want this. You guys don't want to smoke. All right, cool. We finally got it. First loot, first loot, first loot. Come on, come on, come on. What is it? What is it? Sledgehammer. Yikes. Trash, that's that's trash. Machete, you ain't looking too good for us, boys. Master Captain Cooker, I guess that's something. I don't know, maybe I don't know. Where, where, where's my loot? I'm looting the wrong thing, aren't I? Yep, last but not least, a falcon. Not terrible, but not the best. All right, then, on to the next one. All right, but before anything, I gotta go get a quick resupply. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in one second. Ah, uh, there we are. All right, easy now. So no, so again, try your best to get rid of the aggro that's always in back of you, in front of you. And be careful because in the first few seconds of the fight, there will always be aggro. Coming in from behind, from the front, so just be, uh, just be careful of that, okay? So easy, 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 <laughs> Just gotta take out the Vulcan real quick. Zigzagging away, zigzagging away. I could probably just outrun them real quick because I don't feel like, you know, trying to kill these guys. It's annoying me. Oh, I love the aggro. Oh my god, he actually bit me. Yo, I hate that, man. When they get in front of, like, a spider or something... So they get the extra little boost they need in order to hit you. I hate that. I hate that so much. Ooh, 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 that was close. That was very close. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> I'm losing like my batter near. Yeah, I can see why people will have difficulty fighting these guys in the uh in the in the white zone. Like the amount of the amount of aggro that just comes at you is annoying me. I gotta see more guys behind me. And more guys behind me. And dogs behind me. And a leaper trying to end me. Man. Annoying. Oh boy, I messed up. Oh boy, I messed up. You know what? I'm getting tired of this. Dude, I hate the dogs in this game! <laughs> so freaking annoying, man. Leave me alone! Alright, I think I got it this time. I think. I don't know. Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe. I don't know. Where's the other girl? Yeah, no, no. Here comes a doggy. Dude, I hate these dogs, man. Most annoying freaking mini bosses in the game, bro. There you go. Just like that, the aggro should be more or less disappearing because, well, again, that's honestly the only way you can fight these girls without being killed too much. Is none of them flinching yet? Jeez, man. You guys have a lot of health. Relax, girls! Oh boy. You know, I was hoping they'd be flinching by now, but not even close. Not even close, man. You think they'd be flinching by now? Nope. Wait, wait, they won't just heal? Oh, I'm about to say, bro. I was like, yo, chill! Dude, where did the other one go, man? I swear, man, these girls just be separating and disappearing, dude. Like, come on now. I better not start all over again. That'd be mad annoying. Oh, wait, wait, we finally got one. One is dead. Nice. What did I get? Oh, ah, uh, aggro. Nice. That's what I got. Oh, I did kill both of them. I don't know when I killed the other one. Uh, I guess. Cool. GG. I mean, the other one looked like it wasn't even moving anymore. And there's no third race, so... Uh, I guess. GG. <laughs> Alright, let's go see what we got, guys. Okay, guys, so first loot's coming up. Oh, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Please let it be something nice. Ooh, you saw 12. Not terrible, honestly. That's a pretty good loot. That's like a 40k loot right there. Not terrible. Not terrible. Oh my god, the aggro. What do you get? 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 Ah, you left him a trail. Okay, so this wasn't a bad loot run. Was not a bad loot run. Um, honestly, we made around 60k from this one, so yeah, pretty good. Anyway, on to the next one. All right, guys, we're back to the outpost. I wanted to record more, but honestly, I didn't realize that my mic was disconnected. So here's a little clip of how that sounds. All right, guys, so we got some flaming rumblers supposedly, but I don't. Okay, this yes, there is a courtyard. All right, so listen, guys. As you can tell, it sounds like crap, so I'm not trying to give you guys crap, and I'm not trying to blow out your eardrums, so let's just end it right here. I mean, at the end of the day, this is what I got, okay? So all this was from the following four rumblers, I believe. I got a mesh, uh, XT-800, Saber, and another FM Mitra, which wasn't terrible, honestly. It could have been better, but hey, you know, even though I'm a gold member, I still get, you know, a little screwed over with the loot rates, but... <laughs> I mean, then again, it would be too easy if I were getting, like, legendaries every every time I lose. So when I started this video, I had 7 mil in my bank account. So with this, I'm pretty sure I didn't even make half of that back. But let's see how much we made in the loot runs. Is it worth 
having all three of these weapons is it worth it let's check it out let's check it out so i mean in just that boss hunt run alone we made 240k which isn't horrible whatsoever that's really good to be honest i mean all i did was just go out kill the bosses come back wait another 30 minutes wait for the cycle to end uh rinse and repeat so it's not terrible it's just that i get impatient and i use my vulcan but i'm pretty sure someone come if someone more patient comes out and then just uses the rex and the paw i'm pretty sure you wouldn't spend as much as i did on ammo okay i'm pretty sure you guys would be great all right guys i would say that would be the end of the video but again i have a discord server uh after every video that i do you know that's special like this i give away the the weapons and just give back to the community and just pretty much do a giveaway in my discord server but also i'm going to come out with a brand new video series that i've been putting up with me and my staff we just want to bring more content to the channel more ideas fresh things because i know some people want to watch other things other than death frontier even though this is a death frontier channel but eventually i want to grow out of death frontier not saying I'm going to quit the frontier, but, you know, I just want to do other things rather than this game. Because, you know, eventually you do get a little demotivated sometimes. <laughs> but, yeah, guys, everyone is heading out. Uh, you know, join the Discord server. It's pretty cool. We just have, you know, little talks here and there. I'm usually active, but most of the time I'm kind of busy. But when I do talk, I do talk for a while. But, yeah, guys, everyone is heading off. I'll see you guys very soon. Take care. Bye.